I actually deleted Instagram because I have like this constant need to just click on it. I am guilty of putting a lot of my self-worth on doing rather than just being. <laughs> I am exhausted. <laughs> I love it. I love it. I'm exhausted. Yes. Honestly, I feel like since it's been about like, I would say about five days of very inconsistent sleep. <laughs> I don't know if I can do it anymore. It's really been affecting me energy wise, mood wise. There's been a few nights where I have only gotten like three to four hours of sleep yeah because it has affected my day a lot my energy just I'm struggling. but then again it's because i actually haven't been implementing my sleep routine i've been going on my phone late at night so i it causes me to be overstimulated before going to sleep it's kind of my fault yeah so it's something i need to fix yeah What I'm gonna do when I am feeling like a bit discouraged or when I feel like I am losing track of my purpose and my goals is to look at my vision board. I mean, that's why I made my vision board. It's just like a constant reminder, I guess. To remind me of what my goals are, like what I want to achieve this year. because we're trying to be a bit productive today and you know do something anything to contribute towards my goals so today is editing because i mean i love editing it makes me happy so yeah <laughs> it also makes me feel accomplished i love it so it was actually nice to just get away for a little bit um, change up my environment a little bit I feel like when I'm in a rut I like to change up my environment whether that's to go to you know just anywhere outside my house to be honest um, somewhere that's peaceful <laughs> preferably that's when I can just kind of clear my mind and just be more present it helps me be more present when the environment is more peaceful and quiet not that my sister's house was that peaceful because my nephew was kind of screaming a lot today but it was fine it was actually nice to just relax and catch up with my sister and my nephew i did find myself going on social media though i'm not gonna lie i did i i'm guilty like i find myself constantly going on instagram and tiktok i was mindful of it though like i knew that i was doing it and i tried not to fight myself because lately i have been having like this inner dialogue in my head saying no don't do it but then i'm still doing it you know like i'm still i'm like fighting myself from going on social media like there's a part of me that doesn't want to go on because i'm like i'm not going to get anything out of it i'm not benefiting by going on social media right now especially because like i'm just not feeling my best if that makes sense so obviously when you're not feeling your best it's not ideal to go on social media because you're pretty much distracting yourself from how you're feeling and that's not really healthy <laughs> coping mechanism yeah it has become like a habit of mine to constantly be checking instagram and tiktok just cause without any kind of purpose or intention so i'm gonna try and get rid of that habit try um it's gonna take time but it's fine i'll be patient with myself i'll try my best my arms hurt from holding the camera a few days ago i actually deleted instagram like the app just because i have like this constant need to just click on it i just find my fingers just like oh oh instagram yeah deleting the app actually helped a lot because i didn't feel the need to actually click on instagram so i feel like it's a good little hack like if you really want to try to limit your screen time and try to not go on instagram try deleting the app it might work for you i think i'm going to do that now i'm going to delete the app tonight just so that i don't find myself accidentally going on it i just want to like 
I'm not going in there because I'm not gonna clean it up. Can't be bothered. Time to get unready. Time to wind down for bed. I just had to have a little double dog. I just had to have a little snack before I brush my teeth. Because I won't be bothered brushing my teeth if I eat this while I'm in bed. I'm technically in bed. I'm on my bed. When I get into my bed, underneath my bed sheets. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> my battery's gonna die. Yay. Oh no, I don't want my battery to die. So I'm currently on my way to the gym. It is a beautiful day today. I am loving today already. I woke up in a better mood. I just had to cry it out last night. Honestly, I just needed to cry it out because if I didn't, I feel like I would have felt like crap today. I don't know, honestly. It's just one of those things where you just gotta let go, release, allow yourself to cry and then literally it's fine um, because I literally was not crying for any specific reason. I just. I just felt like it <laughs> and sometimes when you feel like crying just cry please like you don't have to literally I'm just gonna turn my engine off um you literally don't need a reason to cry like if your body actually just needs to cry just release it allow it soak it in and and then you feel good after it because you've released whatever it is your body needed to release like even if you don't understand it at the time it's okay just Embrace it. Okay, so I'm at the gym right now and I just started stretching and I didn't realize how fatigued my body is and I think I gotta listen to my body and I'm gonna take it easy on myself today. If I really can't push through for the first exercise, I will go home and just rest. I really need to start taking breaks and resting when my body needs it or oh, even if it's like a mental thing as well, if I need to mentally rest. I need to start doing that and focusing on actually taking care of myself as well as you know actually pushing myself if that makes sense and having the right balance between rest and working hard hello and all that so yeah Okay, I'm proud of myself. I still completed the session. Honestly, I just took it easy on myself and I didn't go too hard and too heavy. It was still a really hard session though. I'm not gonna lie. But I'm proud. I did that. I did just three exercises today. I, and I feel like that was enough. That was just right for me. And yeah, I just feel more accomplished. Because I am guilty of putting a lot of my self-worth on doing rather than just being <laughs> so yeah when I'm productive I do feel good about myself and when I am not productive I feel like crap about myself that's something I am trying to change and I am trying to unlearn but it's gonna take some time at least I'm self-aware that's the first step so yeah <laughs>